Welcome back to part two of your Naples Realtor video series. Next is NAO4. This area includes Pelican Bay, the Waterside Shops, and Artist Naples. Pelican Bay is three plus square miles of luxury golf, condos, single family homes, and high rises, and is well known for its private beach and restaurant, and long boardwalk tram system. On the north side of Pelican Bay is NAO2. This area has the Ritz-Carlton and Vanderbilt Beach. Did you know that Naples is one of only four cities in the U.S. that have two Ritz-Carltons? And one place is the new luxury marina currently under construction there as well. North along Gulf Shore Drive are condos, hotels, and single-family homes. It ends at 110th Avenue and Immokalee Road and the entrance to Delnor Wiggins State Park. This park is known for looking like the rustic 1950s, the way Naples did back in the day. Between Vanderbilt Drive and US 41 is NAO3, Naples Park an area of over 80 blocks of older and newer homes with no HOA, making it very popular to Airbnb. The map continues north along Vanderbilt Drive to NA01 and the Bonita Lee County line. Here's where you'll find Barefoot Beach for Collier County residents. You access it from Bonita Beach Road and like all county beaches, is free for county residents. You need only have your beach sticker on the windshield. That covers the area west of 41 and what most would consider the most desirable real estate in the area. Next is the area between US 41 and Interstate 75. Starting with NA 11 and moving south on the map to NA 16, this area is considered North Naples and has many communities and golf courses. Here you'll find Palm River, Victoria Park, Tiburon, the Vineyards, Pine Ridge, and Gray Oaks, as well as North Collier Regional Park. There are also the major east-west roads like Immokalee Road, Vanderbilt Beach Road, Pine Ridge Road, and Golden Gate Parkway. Did you know that Golden Gate Parkway is the only flyover in the county and was voted as the nicest in Florida when it was completed? Continuing now to NA17, NA18, and NA19, this area is commonly referred to as East Naples. This is the area south of Golden Gate Parkway and includes Davis Boulevard, Rattlesnake Hammock Road, and all the way east to the intersection of US 41 and 951 Collier Boulevard. Starting downtown and going east, you'll find that as Naples grew in the 1950s and 60s, East Naples has the oldest buildings and communities in the area, like Royal Harbor, Brookside, the Government Complex, the Glades, Lakewood, Kings Lake, and more. The Bayshore Redevelopment District has been working to improve the area around Bayshore and US 41 for over 20 years, and the results are starting to show. Celebration Park, the U.S. Pickleball Open, and the new Metropolitan High Rise Project are all improvements to the area. Continuing east on 41, you'll see Laley and lots of older homes, condos, and golf courses. At the eastern tip is Laley Resort, built in the 1990s and known for the beautiful running stallion sculpture at the entrance on U.S. 41. If you look close enough, you can see the transition over time in the construction style of the buildings and homes from the 1970s to the 2000s. Collier Boulevard 951 is the eastern boundary of the incorporated part of Naples and everything going east for about 80 miles is designated rural lands, agricultural and protected. Going south on Collier 951 is NA09, NA38, which includes Rookery Bay, Fiddler's Creek, Isles of Capri and MI01, which is Marco Island. Heading east on 41 is NA37 and NA38, and communities like Reflections Lake, Naples Reserve, and more golf courses. Then you have Collier Seminole State Park, the Picayune Strand State Park, Big Cypress Preserve, and more, all of which makes up part of the Everglades National Park and are protected from development. Here you'll find Everglades City, the first city in the 1920s, Chukaluski, and the Everglades National Park Visitor Center. Naples maps are available in the Realtor store along with 20 different community maps. We have Collier County, we have full color foldable maps, we have subdivisions and waterways, different zip codes and different geo codes, and we also offer the 2021 Collier County wall map. Please let us know if there are other things you'd like to see and hear about Naples, and thank you for watching. That concludes part two. Be sure to watch all three videos.